What's up, YouTube? My name is Clickwood, and I am back again today bringing you guys another episode of the Pink Slip series here on my channel. And today, we actually already saw one person get qualified to play me this week in Pink Slips. He defeated his opponent in the head-to-head -head game, in the play-in game, and now we are playing for Madden 25 Mike Vick. Congratulations to my opponent for making it this far. I will leave a link to his Twitter down in the description below so that you guys can go follow him and congratulate him. But with that being said, it is time to get into the game. I'm a little bit nervous. I saw a little bit of his offense and his defense, and uh, he's pretty good. So uh, hopefully I'm able to keep up. I don't want this to be a blowout and me get my ass kicked. That would be kind of embarrassing. But I've got this new Mike Vick card, so I think that I should be able to keep up at least with the scoring. We'll see what happens, though. Wish me luck, guys. Thank you again for tuning in, and I will talk to you beautiful bitches again soon. First play of the game, and I know my opponent has some good defense, but uh, I'm going to have to try and run it right at him. Let's go, CJ. Oh, I thought I hit him with that back juke, but he barely got that tackle. I don't, know, I don't even know who that was. Cam Chancellor, maybe, or something? I don't know. Got to continue to, con uh, to run the ball right at him here. I have to. There it is. Got off the edge. Look at Donald Penn down the field, just making those blocks. What a beast. CJ, nice, 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 nice run. 42 yards now on two attempts. We are in good shape here. We've ran the ball effectively on our first two plays, and I'm going to try and catch him off guard here. Look where he's moving all of his safeties. I don't know if this is going to work out for me, but we'll see. Beautiful. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. Run him over, Gronk. All right, continuing to move the ball here on offense is a good sign. First and 10, we're going to continue to try and run this football right up the middle. Thurman Thomas for a gain of, what, seven there? Yep, seven-yard gain, nice gain there. Third and two now. I'm going to try and make sure he doesn't get all of his adjustments in. And he didn't. We should be able to pick up this first down pretty easily, and that's going to be a touchdown. Thurman Thomas on the first drive. We let Chris Johnson sit so he doesn't get tired. And we are on the board now. 6-0 to start this game off. Very, very nice first drive for me, and I'm feeling it. So this guy was very effective running the ball in the first game. I don't know uh, exactly what scheme he was running, but I know that he liked to run to the outside, so I am going to try and contain that as much as I can in this one. And we get a sack on the first play. Who was that? Derek Brooks. Beauty, beauty, beauty play. I'm absolutely loving that. And he's going to run hurry up here. Try and catch me off guard, I think. That isn't going to happen, pimps. That isn't going to happen. I'm ready for it. Pick it, baby. Oh, come on, Sean Taylor. No. Oh, that could have been huge. Oh. Third and long now. And we are going to try and just prevent this as much as we can. And he does get a nice gain there. It's going to bring up a fourth and four. I'm assuming that he's going to go for it here, but we'll see. All right, so it is fourth down, and he is going to go for it here. I'm assuming that this is going to be a pass, and it is. And, oh, I can't believe he was able to get that. He threw it short of the first down, and he still picked it up. Not much I can do there. We played pretty good defense, and he was just able to get the first down. His guy broke the tackle. What can you really do there? Nice tackle. Who is that? Pat Pete? Beautiful. Gotta love that. He's gonna run hurry up again here, it appears. And we break off of it and hit him with Pat Willis. Third and seven now as we stopped him for a short gain on second down. He's gonna run play action here. Oh, yes! Nice break up. Nice break up, Pat Pete. Fourth down and he is gonna go for it again here, it appears. Another play action. We're covering the short route. We're covering the short route. And we come to throw the incompletion. We take over on downs. That was all user coverage on my part there. I saw that guy going across the middle. I was not going to let him beat me with that same route again. All right, guys. First and 10 now. And we're going to try and run the ball again. This time off the opposite edge. We pick up some decent blocks there. We gain about three. Not a bad start to the drive here. Now we're gonna try this buck sweep and see if we can get anything going with that. And we've got some blocking here on the edge. Chris Johnson is off to the races and he is going to score another touchdown. That's why you don't go for it every fourth down because you end up giving me the ball in your territory and I'm gonna punch that baby in almost every time. So you better play conservatively against me otherwise you're gonna get burned. Back on defense now and he's gonna come out with another formation that looks like a running formation. And he is going to run the ball up the middle this time. 
and we tackle him after short gain. Not a bad start to this drive for me on defense. Second down, and I feel like a play action pass is coming here, but nope, he did, he did just run it right up the middle. Gains about five that time, so that brings up a third and two. Oh, he's gonna bring, he's gonna run to the opposite side. I knew it, dang it, I couldn't get my guys over there in time. Nice juke there, nice juke. Picks up the first down, not much I could do there. Another run here, and we tackle him again after a short gain. Third down now, and is he gonna run it again? Nope. Oh, who is that? Von Miller? Beautiful sack by Von Miller, and that's gonna bring up a fourth and long now. So my opponent is gonna punt here on fourth and 16 with about a minute left in the half, and we'll see if we can get any points back when we're on offense here. Looks like there's gonna be a punt return here, so we'll see what happens. Uh-oh, oh. Not a bad return there by me, though. Get, got some decent yardage, and we're gonna start this drive off at the 35. All right, so I wonder what he's gonna do here to try and stop the buck sweep. I, this is actually a read option here, so if this DN here doesn't come in at the quarterback, I am going to uh, keep the ball here. And he does go in at the quarterback, so we are going to run off the edge. We've got blocking. Chris Johnson's off to the races again, and he gets taken down from behind by Champ Bailey after a nice game. Chris Johnson is having a hell of a first half, and he didn't even get all the rushing yards. He's got four attempts for 111 yards at this point in the game now, and he brings a blitz here. Oh no, oh he read that though with his linebacker. That could have been a nice gain if he didn't read that so well. Second and 14 and we're gonna try to do that read option again here. And again he commits on the quarterback. Oh look at that blocking. Let's go baby. Nice blocking by Joe Thomas too there down the field. Okay so it is first and goal here. We've only got 13 seconds left though, so if I don't pick up this touchdown, I don't know that I'm gonna be able to put any more points on the board. So this is kind of a risky play. I'm gonna try and throw it into the end zone here and hope that I get a touchdown. If not, I'm gonna try and throw it away and not throw a pick six, because that would be disastrous, disastrous at this point in the game and just kick a field goal if I need to. Yeah, he's got everything covered it looks like, so. Oh, does he though? Uh, yeah, he did. Okay, so I asked Madden what I should do here, and they said to do a goal line fade, so let's see what happens. Get it. Oh, he dropped it. Oh, that was a good pass, though, by Vic. What can you do? Your guy drops it. It's just, there isn't a whole lot you can do. Alshon should have caught that one, though. All right, so we are going to take our three points here, and we are going to go up 17-0 to zero at halftime. He nearly blocked that. That would have made me rage. I'm not going to lie. <laughs> So he comes out in four wide now. He's mostly been running just two wide receiver sets in the first half. So I'm just going to try and make sure that he doesn't beat me deep here. We've got the two safeties over the top here. Or at least one of them is over the top. The other one's just going to be under the middle there. Eh, all right. He gained seven there. Not a terrible start to the half, but not a great start either. He is going to run here. Oh. All right. He picks up the first down there. It was a good play call. What can I say? So he's loving running this hurry up offense, I've noticed. And I just have to make sure that, oh, we get another sack right as I say that. Great, great play there by my defensive line. They are playing extraordinarily well in this one, getting great pass rush. I think everybody's done really well so far on my defensive line. And I really can't complain too much at this point. Third and 19 to be exact. Again, we just need to make sure he doesn't beat us deep here. And he's gonna try and go underneath, isn't he? What is this? Oh, we dropped another pick. Are you kidding me, guys? Come on! That's our interception. I, I can't believe that they didn't catch that. So he is going to go for it here on fourth down. As you can see there, he is one of two so far on the day. Uh, he's running a very odd offensive scheme for a fourth and long, and he's going to run an option, and there's no way this is getting picked up. Not a chance. I read that. There's no way he's picking up an option for a first down against me on fourth and 19. That just isn't going to happen, buddy. All right, we're gonna give him the same look that we did last play. Look at him moving his guys into position. And it's gonna be a QB wrap off the other side. Oh, I wish that my receiver would have gone up and made the second level block, but can't complain. We almost picked up a first down there, not too bad. Third and inches now, and I'm sure he's not gonna expect to run up the middle from me. I'm not really somebody who runs up the middle very often. And we are gonna pick up the first down easily there. Vince Wilfork finally makes a tackle. First and goal at the five. Counter run is coming here, and we cut it up for another touchdown. That is going to put us up four scores now. 
Actually, I thought about it again, and I do need to go for two here, and the reason for it is because that will actually put me up four scores if I get to 20, uh, 25. But if I'm only at 23, it's just a three-score lead if he scores touchdowns. So, here we go. And we pick it up for the two-point conversion. That is a 25-0 lead now. And we are up four scores here as we get close to the fourth quarter. I am doing a great job in this game, both offensively and defensively. Not to toot my own horn, but this game is going exactly how I wanted it to go. He is not doing anything on offense, and that is awesome. Because I, I was watching his game earlier, and I was pretty sure that he was just going to tear me up. Feeling very good here with only 30 seconds left in the third quarter. And he has to move the ball all the way down the field again to pick up a touchdown here. And he's not going to be able to do it very easily as he runs there for 10. But he's only got 31 yards on 9 attempts now. I'm really not too worried about him running. He can pretty much run all he wants as far as I'm concerned. I'm not worried about it. <clears throat> oh gosh, he does go deep. Oh, but look at Pat Pete. So long and lanky. Just easily swats that thing away. Start of the fourth quarter now, and it is starting to get to be time for this guy that he has to make big plays, but he continues to run the ball. I guess he's picking up first downs, but it's not really doing much other than that. I don't know who got injured there. Probably one of my guys, of course. Again, I'm just going to continue to let him run the ball. He is knocking down the clock every single play that he runs the ball. Um, it, it's totally fine with me if he wants to pick up five yards of play. I don't mind. Oh, no. Of course, right as I say that, he picks up like 15. But we just have to make sure that he doesn't get any long plays. I cannot commit on the run. Uh, if I do, I'm going to get beat. So I just got to just gotta stay over the top and not let him go deep on me with any passes. That's basically the name of the game at this point. All right, he's going to continue to try and run the ball, I guess, here. Finally goes play action, and we get the interception with Tashawn Gibson. I knew it. I knew that he was eventually going to have to pass, and we make the right move there. Great interception by Tashawn Gibson. We kept coverage over the top, and he threw a bad pass into coverage. Another run off the edge here. Thurman Thomas has got room. Look at Donald Penn just knocking guys down. Look at that beast. Look at that beast. Thurman Thomas is off to the races. Will he be caught from behind? Nope. Another touchdown for us. And that is going to put us up another. And this game is quickly getting out of hand. He has no shot at stopping me on defense. My offense is just on fire right now with Mike Vick. And that's why I knew, guys, when I got Mike Vick, I would be able to pass the ball or at least have that threat of the pass that I didn't have with Walter Payton. So that was a huge improvement for my team, no doubt about it. Again, we're back on defense. And I'm totally fine if he wants to run the ball. But uh, he's going to have to pass if he wants to put any points on the board, for sure. Yep, another run. Gained eight there. That's fine. 15 rushes for 76 yards is nothing. I'm more than happy with that as, as far as uh, stopping the run goes. But I am not going to get beat over the top. There's just no way. We get another sack there by Von Miller. And that's going to bring us to the two-minute warning here. Third and eight. And he's going to pass again here. Oh, what a pick by Charles Woodson. Oh, baby. What a beast Charles Woodson is. He plays well in run support, and he's amazing in coverage. One of my absolute favorite players in the game, no question about it. Minute 55 now, and this one is for my friend Steven. We're going to try and run QB Rap here and see what happens. Oh, yeah. We got room. We've got room. And he is off to the races. Mike Vick, another touchdown, baby. That's how we do it in this, in this game, baby. That's how we win pink slips. That is how we win pink slips. Fourth and four here. And he's going to pass again. Not going to happen. Knocked away. So, guys, that is going to do it in this one. We are going to run out the clock here. And I am going to walk away with a victory here in Pink Slips over my opponent who did qualify by defeating another opponent who was 99 overall as a team. So, guys, I, I don't know what to tell you. I'm playing decent competition. Everybody that was watching the game earlier was saying that these guys are at least decent players. So, I don't know. You guys are going to have to step up your game if you want to start winning these cards, though, because uh, Mike Vick's staying with me this week. I want to wish good luck to my opponent in the future, but in this game, he just didn't have what it took to beat me. So, it is what it is. I'm going to keep Mike Vick, and I like that, of course. So, guys, with that being said, that is going to do it for this video. Let me know in the comment section below if there's a card that you guys want to play for next week. And also... If you're new to the channel, make sure that you press 
that subscribe button because that is going to be the way that you know when I put up the announcement video to play Pink Slips next week. So, guys, thank you again for tuning in. I really do appreciate it, and I will talk to you beautiful bitches again soon.